And it's interesting to hear, to hear you explain it that way, because we say often at Crucible Leadership and Beyond the Crucible that success and significance aren't mutually exclusive. Um, you can have success and that success can be, you know, also part of a life of significance. What's interesting, as I hear you describe Robin Hood in that way, um, he, in the traditional reading of the Errol Flynn film and the, and the Kevin Costner film, um, he sort of had to cast significance, I mean, cast success aside to find significance. Uh, he he wasn't one who initially was able to to meld those two together. He had to he had to leave behind success. He had to become an outlaw, and then through that and helping the oppressed, he he found significance. And as you said, it's restored. But that's an interesting concept. There's not a whole lot of times we talk about that on this show that success and significance don't exist in the same universe. In the universe of Robin Hood, many times that's true. Su- success, as the world defines it, and significance do not coexist. Yeah, I mean, sometimes you have to be willing to risk it all for uh, for the greater good. And <clears throat> really, every version of Robin Hood that's popular, it's never about him. In the 1938 classic version with Errol Flynn, not only does he want to you know rob from the the rich, the oppressive King John, who is imposing ridiculously high taxes to just to benefit his own wealth and coffers. Uh, but also he wants to help raise money to free uh, King Richard in Austria, you know, help raise ransom money. There's a wonderful scene in the 1938 movie with Errol Flynn as Robin Hood and uh, Olivia de Havilland as Maid Marian, when he's trying to explain to her in you know, the Sherwood Forest what it is they do. And they've just plundered a whole bunch of stuff, you know, uh, taxes from some you know, wealthy uh, henchman of King of, of Prince John. And he asks his men, so men, should we divide up all this money, the spoils for ourselves, or should we use it to ransom King Richard in prison in Austria? What do we do, men? And they all sh- sh- shout, this is for King Richard. In other words, mm. they, they could have used the money for themselves, but none of his men were about themselves. It's all about combating oppression and freeing their beloved King Richard.